Hey guys, welcome back to the Sinsanity. Let's go ahead and get started on the second Sigma stage. Oh, great. F fucking motherfuckers. It's gonna be one of those days. Oh. this oh this is gonna be tragic <laughs> oh, fuck you! You're not allowed to hit me anymore! Hmm. Suppose that one was free. Burn. Bitch. Hmm. <laughs> There we go. Eh, too short. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> we get to go fight an old friend again. And you know how the penguin gets his cool animation when he gets hit by his weakness? Eagle has nothing like that. He just dies. It's pathetic sometimes how easy the weapons make these fights. Ah, finally we get to a new boss. Of sorts. 
Behold, the almighty and terrible face. Yeah, I'm not the only one who saw that, right? I touched the spikes and I didn't die. I am a god! Apparently. Yeah, there's really not much to say about that stage. It's more or less just a straight shot into nothingness. But hey, let's keep going. Since we're on a roll today, apparently. Here to yesterday. Eat it. Did you think I was kidding when I said this Spark Mandrel's power made him a joke? I fucking wasn't. God damn. See, I can do jumps sometimes. Hmm. Chameleon. Most annoying weakness, apparently, to use. Eh. Alright, that's good. It's hard not to get hit by this guy when it really comes down to it. Because at least one of his attacks is essentially a random number generator. But hey. Simple and straightforward. Yay! The monkey's back! Now this guy... is kinda sad. Most things involving him are sad. If I really think about it. 
mean, just look at what his power did to the armadillo who wrecked my shit. Nine fucking times. Yeah, stupid fish. So this guy's weakness is the rolling thing. He's the rolling shield. But also, he's got a second weakness. I think. Or is that only in the re release? Oh, there it is! <laughs> you can cut off his arms. Making this fight laughable. now. I don't remember if it's actually worth doing though. I should use that more often. Oh, hey, the elephant. Boomerang! Bam. Because that... Because for some reason, the boomerang cutter just cuts things off everybody in this game. Which... I'll go ahead and say it. Something they really... Sh they put more effort into the rest of the Mega Man X games. They could have done stuff like that with more of the weapons. Some of the later ones... You start to wonder if they were really even putting any effort into it to begin with. I don't need to be getting depressing yet. That doesn't come until like X5. Alright. <sighs> yeah, it's a tank. Not much else to say. I mean, we'd be more pissed off, but... The thing just looks fucking ridiculous!
And I just have to say... <sighs> the upgraded X-Buster in this game is kind of it's pathetic. It Against most bosses, it doesn't even do more damage than the normal one. And the only real ones that it's actually cool to charge the super weapon, the weapons hub, is the chameleon stink. And maybe the rolling shield, but that's just it! Beyond that, none of the others do anything cool. And I get the feeling I haven't said much throughout this, but that's really because once you get to the Sigma stages in this game, there's not much to say. It's just a straight shot. And then you get to the big guy. But anyway, I'm probably in a rant. I'm about to rant if I keep going on this. So, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.